Hey guys, it's Akira, and I'm getting in the kitchen. And today it's going to be a video where I show you guys how to make a alcoholic milkshake. And let's see. So let me show you everything you're gonna need if you wanna make this yourself at home. So first of all, an ice cream scooper. Second of all, this is eggnog ice cream. It has been melting for a few minutes, which is kind of bad. I'm gonna put it in the freezer until we're ready, but um, you can see like what it looks like. It's like melting a little bit on the sides. Um, I put it in the freezer, I mean the microwave for 30 seconds, and then I put it, um, I let it sit out here for a few minutes while I was like getting ready for the video, cause I had to curl the bangs. <laughs> I try to say it like that way, but I don't think it was even noticeable at all. Anyways, um, this is chocolate martini wine cocktail. Now, some people are going to like this, some people aren't. If you don't like sweet, like ice cream, like alcoholic drinks, you're not going to like this. Because my boyfriend personally, he didn't like it. So, yummy. Yeah, I love this. Let's give it a little sniff. Yeah, it smells really good. Um, why are we drinking today? Um, it's like that winter holiday vibe type of drink. And also, um, it is my friend's birthday, so that's a reason to celebrate. Um, yeah, so hopefully we see her today. But for now, we're going to fuck her up. So... It doesn't really matter that the ice cream is melting, it's more for flavor, because last time, the ice cream, it just provided like a slushy-like consistency. So now that I know exactly what's needed, I can like perfect the cream and show it to you guys. So, you guys are welcome. I did the trial and error so that I can find the amazing combo for you guys. Okay, so here we have the blender. And yeah, you're gonna need a blender too. Sorry, I forgot to mention that. So we're gonna get the eggnog ice cream. This, it's gonna act as eggnog essentially, okay? So the eggnog ice cream is more for the eggnog. So the ice is gonna help it become slushy like. So we're gonna put the ice on the bottom. We're just gonna put four. Because the ice cream is already going to help, but it's just going to help it like boost it to that next level. So, four ice cubes, and then we're going to put some ice cream. So, you can put as much as you like. It depends how much alcohol you want, too, for um, how much ice cream you should put. So, um, this is going to be actually a lot, but I'll just make a lot of alcohol with it. So, this is... um. 13.9% and if you want to know the brand it's Rancho La Gloria and I got it at Food for Less if you guys are curious and it's ready to drink so you can literally drink it as is like it's not terrible yeah it's not terrible so we're gonna put that in there I guess the rest wasn't much. Okay. Mm. It wasn't much at all. Okay. We're gonna add some more alcohol in there because that's not gonna be strong at all. Hold on. Give me a second. Now, if there was more chocolate martini, I wouldn't have added more, but I'm going to add some Smirnoff. It's literally watermelon vodka infused with natural flavors. doesn't sound like it tastes good at all, but the reason I'm going to add it is because, yeah, that doesn't seem like a lot of alcohol. Okay. So, I'm going to add some of this. It's like two shots, so, yeah. Add half of it. Oops. So we add half of that, and yeah, let me make sure that all of it is out. Oh yeah, that's like raw. Okay, and let's add another ice, because that vodka was like hella warm. Oh, and we're 
just the and just a tiny bit of vanilla extract because we added um literally just a tiny bit okay because we added the vodka and it's literally flavored like shit or something i don't know but yeah so now we're gonna ice cream <laughs> eggnog because it's like not the consistency I want. And then an ice. Just one ice. Let's do milkshake. some on my hand but it's fine top it with some cinnamon okay that's the drink you guys didn't get to see me top it with the cinnamon let me do it for you guys okay now let's try it cheers mm. Mm -hmm. yep so if you make it at home tag me at chiropractor on whatever social media um yeah it was really good i liked it so if you guys want to make this at home i recommend it